Monica Loya without explaining too much. I'm just gonna show you. <laughs> Ta -da! So by the time I edit and post this video, I will be 38 weeks pregnant and I'm so happy, very, very excited. Thank you guys for being here and for being so patient with me. I know it's been a while and I'm just so glad to be back. I barely was able to finish up on the studio, more or less on how I wanted it to be for today. Um, I am going to be uh, showing you guys and talking about all the stuff that we bought from Bye Bye Baby. And I also wanted to wait a little bit to show you guys the stuff that, um, whew, I'm already running out of breath. <laughs> um, show you guys the stuff that we received from family members and friends already. Um, it's all very, very adorable, very cute. Some products that we got um, from some companies as well for him. I'm very excited. And uh, this is one of the gifts that we received from um, Mitchell's mom and it's literally the set for the Star Wars um, what's it called Lamb <laughs> Lambs and Ivy yeah Lambs and Ivy signature um, they sell this at Bye Bye Baby I don't know if they have this at um, Target and Walmart I don't think so but um, ever since I saw this I completely just fell in love with it um and especially i mean it doesn't come with it but i mean <laughs> it's the set you know what i mean and it's the um the mobile for his crib so <laughs> r2d2 chewbacca c3po and the millennium falcon and it's so cute and this is better angle of it right there. So with the Death Star. <laughs> so, so adorable. Let me just like update you guys real quick on our life situation. Cause I know it's been a while. <laughs> um, we did move um, houses. We sold our other house. The market was kind of crazy. So we just decided it was the best thing to do since two years from now, we are gonna move from states and uh so we moved into military housing and i'm loving it so far and i also got my own room for my studio uh my studio in the, in the other house was actually part of the garage so it was smaller and it was also conjoined with the washer and dryer area so you know it was a little hot in there and it got really really cold when it was winter time so it's this is like the perfect setup. I'm very, very happy with it. So just a little, you know, update on our life. And it probably wasn't a good idea for me to have waited so long to show you guys the stuff that we got because uh, some of it I might've forgotten if we got it ourselves or if it was a gift. So I am very sorry in advance if I get it wrong. I'm just gonna, you know, try my best. But I know for a fact this was also a gift. This was from uh, this was from Auntie Shelley, and it's a beautiful, beautiful blanket with Baby Yoda. It's so cute. <laughs> and this was handmade, you guys. I think she got this from like an Etsy shop. So beautiful. This is from Delorlau Designs. So, and it comes with a cute little bee. So cute. We got some bibs, little onesies and pajamas. Yeah, both were definitely gifts. And so was this one right there. And I think it was the same one, but it's like an older, um, it's a bigger size. And then this is the stuff that we actually did buy. Bye bye baby. So I wanted something quick and simple for bath time because I do have a two and a half year old that's a little monkey right now and I love her. But um, yeah, I wanted something simple and something I could just grab and throw in the dryer whenever I'm done with it. Um, and it's just that cute little flower that you put on the sink and it's going to be very helpful for also when we have family. Um, 
and they can just grab this and place it into our kitchen sink and you know give them a little bath and yeah it's that flower one blooming bath lotus and i got it in gray we also bought this i forgot we got this this is zen one convertible swaddle and um i remember camila didn't like her hands to be tucked in um she was always a free spirit <laughs> And uh, so uh, this one has zippers in his little arms. So, and it's weighted. So it just makes him feel more comfortable. And you can, those are all the different types of ways you can use it. Oh my gosh, I'm like looking at this stuff and I'm like, <sighs> I just, I just can't believe it. You know, it just went by so, so fast. I'm so distracted with Camila that I didn't realize how fast everything has just been. And he's healthy and he's just so happy. He's doing great. Um, a little update on myself, I guess. Um, my feet are ridiculously swollen lately. Yeah, just bending down has been a little tough. But other than that, like, the pregnancy itself has been pretty good I've been more active than I was before hubby's home. oh and hubby's like two minutes away from his from his work so it's awesome he gets to come home for lunch <laughs> we also got another Sophie Sophie Le Paris 1961 and you can get this anywhere really Target by my baby it's so cute. It's very easy for them to grab, and it's just like the perfect teether. Camila had one, and she loved it. She like swung it around everywhere and took it everywhere with her. Um, of course, I wanted him to have a brand new one. So I almost forgot to mention we also purchased a beautiful swing for baby Johan. We do have um, two floors now, so we need one floor. The bottom floor and one for our bedroom so we went ahead and bought this one and we actually got this and bye bye baby on a sale so we're very very happy with it <laughs> we're gonna be setting up and um yeah we'll see how he likes it and then here are some more goodies that we got these are some um kind breastfeeding storage milk bags Remember, I'm going to put that site on the description below where if you are military and you have, you know, TRICARE, you are um, eligible for a free breast pump. I actually have mine shipped today and I was so, so excited. I got the Spectra S1 with like 90 free um, storage milk, uh, milk bags. So I'm very excited and they look like this. And again, um, I will post that video with the baby registry must haves, but like you connect this into like this bottle thing and you don't have to even clean any bottle, you just throw it out and you're done. So it's, it's really cool. And so that's my favorite system that I use and I used it for a whole year. If you guys have any questions on breastfeeding, please let me know. I'm, I will be more than happy to talk to you guys about that. But anyway, this is another thing that we got and it's the Haka and it's just like a manual pump that you know you um, you put on one breast while you're breastfeeding and whatever is leaking it will catch it so you won't be wasting any breast milk because that is absolutely precious and you don't want to waste that so this one has a lid um, some of them don't and I would definitely recommend getting the lid one because it's going to drop. And that will be painful. Um, we got some waterproof liners for changing diapers. I got a little pacifier holder thing for my diaper bag. I thought it was very cute. Oh, and then we got these cute little saddles for him. Oh, he's a little newborn. And this part will be a little bit more boring because it's just close, but I'm going to go by super fast. It's just a cute little sporty outfit. It's a onesie with a zipper and a little beanie. So very cute. Some 
some night ones. So that's another one. This one we did buy. Burpees has such good quality papers and gowns and all that stuff. So cute. Welcome to the world. And then newborns. Look at this outfit, you guys. Look at this. Oh my goodness. Spider Man, of course. And this one says, um, handsome runs in the family. Yeah, these were definitely a gift from um, Grandma Sheila. I remember now. I just accidentally mixed them up in here um, during the move and all that. So I love my mama. And then Grandma Sheila also got us the crib sheets, the sheet for his crib. The set actually comes with some cute little stickers on there too. Those are really cool. This was another favorite, and this was from my cousin Marcy. Thank you so much. Um, it's a beautiful car seat cover from uh, Milk Snob, and it's Star Wars themed. I love the colors, the design is absolutely beautiful. So and it can be used for many different things like um, shopping cart or when you go out and eat at a restaurant, breastfeeding cover, with baby Yoda. <laughs> of course, so cute. <laughs> Thank you ladies, I love you guys so much. We also got some blankies, some, um, it called shower towels these are from grandma sheila so cute and then look at this one you guys it's so cute very cute with a little beanie and it's like a gown not a gown cars with little sharks cars and trucks these little pajamas and then these are my favorite. <laughs> so thank you, Grandma Sheila. Some little socks for when he's a little older. Some burp cloths and some dinosaur onesies. So, oh my goodness, look at these yellow shorts. And also we received a an amazing car seat from, um, Nana. This one that we got is the Graco uh, Slim Fit. I can't remember the name. I'll go ahead and post it on there as well for you guys. I'll post as much of the stuff um, that's not closed on the description so you guys can check it out and see if you know there's anything that you are interested in. Um, but yeah, so the car seat was actually super super awesome and Camila loves it. Um, I also wanted to thank Love Every for sending us their play gym. This is the, the play gym and it's absolutely beautiful. And so every section has its purpose so and I will go ahead and read you guys what the sections are this little book that it comes with it's really awesome this is mainly for tummy time but um, it can be used as a little canopy as well so it's really amazing and they sell this at Bye Bye Baby, Target. Uh, I will also go ahead and write down my affiliated link in the description below for you guys so you can check out their play kits as well. And I'll go ahead and talk about that in just a second. So for this, 
what is included is the activity guide and then it comes with an organic cotton ball, organic teething ring, a batting ring, and um, an actual teething ring. And it's wooden, it's organic, and it's all like Montessori based. So it's very beautiful. And this explains every single thing that you can do with this play gym, which is incredible. And obviously there's stages for it as well. So you've got zero to 12, three to four months, five to six months, seven to eight, nine to 10, and 11 to 12 months. And they explains so perfectly, you know, they prefer high contrast images and it's for them to focus from eight to, eight to 14 inches away. Sometimes their eyes may cross. So they'll start tracking moving objects around five weeks. These are the things that it comes with. So there's the organic ball and the feeding room and it rattles so it makes sound and it gets them so happy and excited. So ah, I can't wait. And then when they are getting a little older, it comes with a little canopy that you can transform into a little space for them and it's all cozy and cute. As far as their play kits, um, those are those are definitely Camila's favorite toys. She plays with them every single day and uh i have to pick up her playroom at least twice a day because <laughs> it gets pretty messy <laughs> and uh so we we received some new toys from love every and she got the 28 29 and 30 months play kit and basically it's a subscription to a montessori based toy company and they are toys are, are developed by child development experts so it's a great way for them to learn without any electronics any flashing lights any batteries it's all very natural organic and very beautiful so these are some of the toys that come in the play kit and <laughs> her favorite right now is that uh, pinkies up picnic set <laughs> She grabs me and takes me with her to her little table near her kitchen and you know we play tea set all the time and she's she's so obsessed with it and she she even like puts the blanket on top of the the table and sets it up all nice <laughs> and when it's time for us to put away the toys she gets really upset because she wants them there to be able to play with them again because she's that's how obsessed she is with them basically what the tea set is for is to you know develop the pretend play and it's very exciting for her because she really is starting to do that really really well with the tea set and, and her little stuffed animals and and characters that she gets with her toys and she unfolds the blanket and the napkins and she lays them out as a little picnic and so cute and so what this says right here is that by 30 months my child will start to pretend play more often with themes such as cooking cleaning or caring for a baby which she already does really really well some children also like to assign roles so you're the child and they're the parent and then they may bring a doll along to act out their nurturing side so very very adorable and then um, so you can do uh, the balancing the balancing liquid and solid volumes right now she's been grabbing her food and placing it inside the little cans and she gets very like concerned as to why they keep on falling down and <laughs> she doesn't know why yet but she's getting there she's getting there um, and she, that's another one of the toys that she doesn't like for me to put away because she just wants it there laying out so she can grab it and play with it fast. And this for this one that says, at this age, your child may start using tools to solve problems. For example, using a bucket to carry several items at once requires both foresight and an ability to invent new methods to reach a goal. They also can use the scale to learn concepts such as balance and weight and the contrast between heavy and light. Um, and then we also have 
the really cool um, glue set that she got. And this one's holding a brush and learning how to stick things together. Your child is learning how to stick one piece of paper onto another by spreading glue on one side and turning it over. Learning to use glue and paste encourages creativity as well as hand-eye and fine mortar planning skills. It also helps them understand the concept of stickiness, which of course she will make a mess and it's totally okay because mama gets to stay home and clean all of them. <laughs> so amazing toys so far. She's been playing with them for, I want to say a week. Those are the first things that she goes to. She, she doesn't even play with any of her other toys right now. <laughs> and I'm very, very happy that I built her playroom in a, in a Montessori style way with the cube organizer and the toys laying out for her to pick and choose what she wants to do. And instead of having them already um, like puzzled in and, and fixed up, I have them laying out on the side. Um, that way she can actually grab them and play with them and um, be more interested in them as well with a toy rotation that I like to do with it. So it's all very exciting and I love, love their play kits. Again, I'm going to go ahead and place that affiliated link in the description below. Um, if you do decide to subscribe to their toys, um, make sure to use my link. I will be profiting off of it a little bit. Um, so I will go ahead and link that on there. And um, I don't know if it'll have my name or not, but I'll make sure that you guys can see it. Very, very happy with Love Every. If you guys have any questions, please let me know in the comments below and I will go ahead and answer them as soon as possible. I think we pretty much got everything down. I think I talked to you guys about everything that I wanted to. So thank you so much for being here. I'm so excited to be back. I'm going to try and do um, next week a what's in my hospital bag video. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys. I'm so, so excited. Um, I really want to film that video. I'm not quite ready because I wanted to do this one before. Um, and of course, talk about Love Every as well. And so that is my plan. I'm going to try and shoot that video sometime next week and post it as fast as possible. Thank you guys again for being here and for all your support. I love you guys so much. Also, um, for you guys to keep up with me on a daily basis, I'm going to post my Instagram on there as well. I take a lot of pictures of Camila and myself <laughs> just on things that we do normal normally in uh I did have some people reach out to me and ask me, you know, what my Instagram was. So I'm going to go ahead and link it on there as well. Um, but uh, yeah, if you are new to my channel, again, don't forget to like that button and subscribe and hit the notification bell as well. So you get notified when I have a new video. So thank you guys so much. I love y'all and we'll see you guys next time. Besitos.